he should. Uh-uh. No, you should. If you have to say you should have done something, then you've wasted already. My name's Dave Finale, DaveFinale.com. And also, hey, check out all of these are on YouTube at Real Estate Skill Builder. Go ahead and go there. Check out all the other episodes, episodes, all the other videos. Let's call them videos. That rise everything in episode, right? And uh, hey, Chris, hey, Colin, uh, Real Estate Skill Builder on YouTube. Subscribe and make sure you hit that little bell. So anyway, so um, we're here talking about the word should, right? A lot of people, oh, I should have done this and I should have done that. No, you want to get to the mindset and to the point where should doesn't even exist. Like you've already done it. So if you have to say, I should have done something, forget it, man. I should have done this, I should have done that. Hey man, you know what? I should have been up an hour early today. I didn't do it. So what did I do? I kind of like was sluggish. I know I want to get out here and run and be done by, you know, completely done at home by 7 a.m. and done with the videos, the whole thing. But I didn't do it. So I know that I've got to push through and get, get done what I've got to get done. It's not that I should have. I, I didn't. So I'm not going to even talk about it. I'm just going to do. Do you get what I mean? Does that make sense? You know, so, so a lot of people like, 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 you know, you do a project and it didn't come out wrong. It didn't come out right. Right. And well, you should have done it this way. You should have done it that way. Well, here's the thing. You probably knew the right way or the, the other way to do it. And you thought about it, but you didn't do it. A lot of times, you know, your first thought is always your best. But if another way comes into mind that makes you stop and think, then you've got to do it or consider it. You know, should doesn't take into the word consider. You have to be able to consider everything along the lines. Like, for instance, when I did not wake up on time, well, on the time at the time I wanted to today, you know, I had to consider the circumstances. You know, I woke up, I felt tired. So I'm gonna let my body tell me what to do. And I'm not gonna say at four o'clock today, man, I should have gotten that extra hour of sleep. No, I let my body help me out. It told me what to do, just like my run. Usually it's five miles. So today I decided to do a harder three and it worked out because I, you know, I crushed it. I did, did really well. It wasn't easy, but then again, nothing worthwhile. Well, a lot of things that are worthwhile take work and are gonna make you uncomfortable. This may be physically uncomfortable, right? So today, instead of worrying about worrying tomorrow about what you should have done today because you didn't end the week right, and by the way, you know, it, it can, you can say end the week, even though you might be a real estate professional. Your week does end and a new one starts. So on Monday, I want you to start the day and start the week to do morning, Stacy. I want you to start what you've got to do and just do it. Consider everything and do it. Don't go nuts and worrying about, you know, I should have done this last week. I should have done that last week. You didn't do it, damn it. You didn't freaking do it. So right now, I should end this video. <laughs> Not gonna. Anyway, so we are done, and uh, I want to wish everybody a, a happy, happy day. Uh, crush it. Go out and attack it, and don't take any shit from anybody. My name is Dave Finale. Check me out on DaveFinale.com. You can also see most of these videos on a, a, on one of my YouTube channels, Real Estate Skill Builder, and later today, uh, check out. Uh, Real Estate Talk TGIF, that's also available on YouTube. Thanks a lot. Have a great day. Again, DaveFinale.com.